Libra, what's going on, baby? <laughs> what's up, Libra? Happy Friday, sugar. I hope you all are doing well. Welcome back, those of you that's returning, and welcome if you are new and you're tapping in for the first time. I'm happy to have each and every one of you here with me, Libra. What's going on? Thank you guys for all the likes, the comments, the shares, the subscribes, the donations. I greatly appreciate it all. Libra, I see it all. Nothing goes unnoticed. You guys are amazing. And I love y'all. I love you so much, Libra. I love you so much. Shout out to those of you that have become new members of my Patreon as well. I see that. I'm greatly, greatly, greatly appreciative. Um, what's up, Libra? What's up? What's up, baby? What you got going on? What you got going on, Libra? We about to get a message for you today this is a general reading meaning everything you hear may not necessarily be for you please use your discernment take only what resonates with you and leave the rest for somebody else out there don't force it if it's not your message okay baby all right libra i hope you have an amazing day i hope you have a beautiful weekend i hope you guys have been enjoying the month of march all right I hope y'all have been enjoying y'all month. I hope you enjoy your weekend. And Libra, we about to get into it. Let's see what's going on. See what's in the energy for you guys. I'm going to start off right with the tarot. Um, you know what? Yeah, let's start off with the tarot. And then we'll pull some fortune. We'll pull like maybe some fortune oracles or some affirmations uh, towards the end, okay? All right, Libra. Libra, let's see what's going on. Let's see what's happening. What's happening, Libra? What's happening? <laughs> Something significant about the movie ATL, okay? Somebody here could be watching that movie ATL. Or you could be um, dealing with someone who loves that movie. Maybe you love that movie. That could be your favorite movie one of your favorite movies right but i'm hearing something about the movie atl i'm hearing i got some cut it last night you got some cut it last night <laughs> somebody got some cut it last night libra you so protected okay we got the strength card here and the um seven of wands all right i feel like somebody is unhappy about that okay somebody's unhappy about that they could be a leo or queen of pentacles in the reverse that's unhappy about that Okay, a Leo, a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. I feel like somebody here is very unhappy. Uh, yeah, somebody here is very burdened by your protection. Somebody here is unhappy and burdened by your protection. Your ancestors guarding you. Yeah, somebody here like, fuck out of here. I don't know, Libra. I guess somebody was on some bullshit with y'all. Still trying to attack y'all. But seeing that you heal like Wolverine, <laughs> somebody here fucked around and found out. Somebody here sees that you heal like Wolverine, you heal in your sleep. Yeah, it's a Queen of Pentacles in the reverse that can't believe this shit. This person could be an Earth sign, but they don't necessarily have to be. But for some of you, it's definitely a Virgo, Taurus, or a Capricorn, and, a, and or a Leo, okay? Or somebody with that highly aspect, a strong Earth, strong Leo. I'm getting here that this is at least two people for some of you guys. These people are disappointed. I mean, they're really disappointed. Like, Libra, how you protect her like that? Like, that don't even make sense. These motherfuckers are monsters, okay? I'm hearing whoever these people are, they're monsters. <laughs> ah, monsters. Remember that show? Remember that show? Ah, monsters. <laughs> they're real. It's real monsters. Ah. <laughs> yeah, these motherfuckers are monsters. But now they bitch made, okay? They scared. They scared of your protection. I'm hearing somebody here that bitched up. They scared of your protection. Libra, you can have strong fire placements in your chart. You can have strong Aries, Leo, or Sag. This King of Wands in the reverse is like maybe wanting to come to you, wanting to talk to you. you like, nah, I'm good. You know what I'm saying? I'm good. Queen of Swords, your intuition is too on point. You be on point about everything, Libra. You're showing up as the Queen of Swords and High Priestess. When I tell you, not only are you intelligent, it's like, your intuition be on the money, okay? Like some of y'all definitely was born with some sort of psychic gifts or you just extremely intuitive, but you just know, you know better, 
I'm here. You know better, so you do better and you choose better. And I just feel like whoever this person is, they feel like a damn fool right now because they came for you not knowing your ranking, not knowing how protected you are. Yeah, this person could have been walking around lying on you and now they got themselves in a world full of trouble. They got themselves in a world full of trouble here. Yeah. Okay? This is somebody that tried to harm you. Okay, Libra? But you happy. Somebody here wants you to be like stuck, trapped, glued to the bed or some shit like that. But you in the nine of cups, you chilling. Libra, I'm also hearing for some of you. Um, yeah, it's like you heal. You heal from a betrayal. Somebody here also thought that you was going to be all bent out of shape and, you know, all sad and you know, destroy, you know, beyond repair. <laughs> like, somebody here thought you was going to be so fucked up over the fact that they betrayed you. Like, somebody here wanted to cause burdens for you, okay? So that you would be self-sabotaging. You would be too hurt and too sad and too depressed to get up and continue to make something of yourself. Somebody here wanted you to self-sabotage and just give up on yourself. Just walk away from everything that you got going on, everything that you've built in. Somebody here just wanted you to say, oh, fuck it. I'm too hurt. You know what I'm saying? I'm too hurt to even do anything. Get the fuck out of here. I feel like you being betrayed or you being hurt or you being bullied actually fueled you with more strength, more power, more determination. And she did the complete opposite of what these people thought it was going to do. Instead of breaking you, they only built you stronger. Yeah, four of wands. And now your wishes are coming true. You got a lot of success here. Wish fulfillment, 11-11. Abundance, okay? A multitude of things. And these people getting karma now. So, I mean, what what really happened here? They That's why they feel foolish. Ain't nothing happened to you. Not only did they build you stronger, you simply fucking winning out here. And they getting karma for the injustice that they've done. They're under heavy judgment for the injustice that they've done. Somebody here could be a Taurus. Somebody here could be another Libra like you. Somebody here could be a Leo. Somebody here could have that in their chart. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, these people are childish. Childish as, as all get out. I'm hearing they're thieves. These people thought they was about to have a new beginning that included some sort of wealth. They are realizing now that they ain't getting shit. They realizing now that the will is actually turning in your favor. Luck is on your side. You chilling. Will of fortune in the upright. You on the right side of things. Good karma. Dharma. This king of wands in the reverse that keeps showing up is pissed. Them and this money hungry queen of pentacles in the reverse are pissed because they thought for a fact that they was about to have some new beginning when they had a lot of abundance and finances here. No, they ain't getting shit but karma. Yeah, could be a Leo. I keep seeing Leo. This person could definitely be a Leo. And they could have been working together with a Virgo, Taurus, or a Capricorn. Yeah, they was working together with an Empress in the reverse. They could have been working together with a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, or another Libra. But I'm telling you, all these people are like, what do you mean we're not getting anything? Bitch, what I just said, y'all ain't getting shit. <laughs> Spirit says y'all ain't getting shit but karma. Yeah, y'all ain't getting shit but judgment. Heavy judgment on your head. Big karma on your head. Judgment in the reverse. Big price to pay to fuck up. Okay? <laughs> these motherfuckers got a lot of karmic debt. And now they ain't heavy regret and they disappointed. Yeah, they ain't heavy regret and disappointed because they ain't shit work out in their favor. They not in heavy regret and disappointed because, Libra, you're a good person and you didn't deserve any of this. No. They in heavy regret and disappointed because they ain't getting shit. They ain't getting nothing that they was expecting. For some of you, this could be your own karmic-ass family. Okay? Mm. These people unhappy. They upset. They don't know what to do. They really want to come towards you, but they know that you too intelligent. Somebody here in this group know that you not with it. Somebody here in this group know that you ain't playing no fucking games. You too smart. Somebody here could be trying to use children, put children in the mix to, um, you know, finesse you. So if you have any, like, younger siblings or anything like that, somebody here could be trying to put them up to saying something to you so that 
they could finesse you into talking to them or some weird shit like that. These people are going through a towel moment. Mm -hmm. These people are going through a towel moment. And I, I'm hearing you better not help them. They can't believe this shit. Somebody here can't believe what's happening in their life. Somebody here can't believe how personal God takes it when somebody goes against you. Somebody knows that everything that they're experiencing right now has a lot to do with the betrayal. They know what they're going through has a lot to do with how they treated you. Libra, you in the nine of pentacles. Very independent, very self-sufficient, abundant, powerful, responsible, knowing your worth, out here looking good, smelling good, feeling good. And this person that you used to share home with or have children with or, this, or these karmic family members of yours, they're in shambles. These people are in shambles. Their world is flipped upside down because these people really thought that they was about to be living their best life. They got tricked. They got bamboozled. I'm hearing these people got tricked. They got bamboozled. Whoever these people are in your life, Libra, well, they're not really in your life, okay? They want to be in your life. But these people that used to be a part of your life, they got tricked. They got bamboozled, okay? But some of you, these people are broke now because they were spending money that they didn't even have yet. They was just so sure that this shit was going to work out in their favor and they was going to collect off of you in some way, shape, or form. That for some of you, they spent money already that they ain't had. They spent the money They spent the money before they got it, Libra. And now these people like, oh, fuck. Some of you could have a Leo, another Libra, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn going against you. Those are the signs I have. But they keep missing it. They keep missing their mark. They keep missing their target, which is you, Libra. Ace of Cups in the reverse to the Seven of Wands to the Shrine. You're too strong. Your protection is too motherfucking strong. Yeah, the devil keep trying to come for you. The devil and the Five of Swords. And that shit keep getting blocked out. I know the devil like, damn, I can't break this bitch. Nope, you can't. <laughs> the devil tired. The devil angry. <laughs> Shrimp in the reverse to the devil. Somebody here be a Capricorn, a Leo. Yeah, working together with multiple people. A Queen of Cups in the reverse. Yeah, everything I'm saying is the truth. These people are pissed off. Like, who the fuck is this strong? Like, this doesn't make any sense. <laughs> That's how they feel. Who the fuck is this strong? This doesn't make any sense. I'm hearing that you're making non-believers believers. Yeah, they keep... Because you are Earth Angel. You are Earth Angel. And they keep doing this spell work on you, Earth Angel. They just keep doing it. Temperance to the moon. These motherfuckers just keep doing spell work on you, Earth Angel. They just keep trying. They keep doing it. Okay? They keep trying to do shit in your blind spots and hide shit from you. Yeah, these people ain't receiving nothing. Somebody here gonna have a Taurus moon. Or strong Taurus placements. But I'm telling you, somebody here ain't receiving a motherfucking thing. This is nothing going. This this is nothing going out, nothing coming in. Six of Pentacles in reverse. They empty, they penny pension. These motherfuckers done cursed themselves with poverty coming for you. I don't know if they realize that or not. They realize that not. I, I don't know if they realize that yet or not. But I'm telling you, these people curse themselves with pro uh poverty. Six of wands in reverse, they feeling defeated. These people feeling defeated and they feel like it's bad news to see that you are still good, that you have healed and that everything that they try to steal from you is being restored. Everything that they have stolen from you is being restored tenfold. Okay. God got you. Don't you worry about a thing. The sun. I told you. Y'all hear that? Alarms. The sun and the three of cups is a state of a fucking emergency for you to be this strong, for you to be this powerful, for you to be celebrating, for you to have clarity regarding what was done in the dark. What was done in the dark has been illuminated to you. The moon to the sun to the three of cups and you still chilling. You still happy. That's another thing that's pissing them off. The fact that you don't give a fuck. They like, damn, you don't even give a fuck about what we did to you. No, you got to live with that. You got to take that up with God. Because he about to whoop your ass even more. That's who you got to take it up with. Libra, you ain't stunning these people. You don't give a fuck. And they know that. And that's another thing that's just like, that's just the icing on the cake. The fact that you don't give a fuck. The fact that you still choosing peace. You still choosing happiness. The fact that you ain't even contacting these people to get at them. The fact that you ain't even acknowledging what the fuck they did by cursing their asses out. That shit hurts. They expecting some sort of reaction. Libra, say something. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> These people said, Libra, say something. Say something to me, goddammit. 
curse me out, say something to me. Yeah, you like, no, nah, I ain't got nothing to say. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got nothing to say. I ain't got nothing to say. You, you ain't got shit to say. These people are like, what? You ain't going to say nothing? Nope. Leave I'm here, you ain't got shit to say. They heartbroken now. Now these people got the nerve to be heartbroken. Pussies. Yeah, a bunch of fucking pussies. Yeah, I said it. They bitch me. They bitch me. And they feel foolish now. Because the only thing they did was curse themselves. The only thing that they did was cause endings and law and and now they got multiple losses here in their life. They feel foolish. Yeah, this emperor in the reverse. This motherfucker walking around mad. Walking around mad. This could be somebody daddy for some of y'all. This could be your father or others of you. This could be like a father figure. This man may have children. He a piece of work though. He a narcissist. And somebody here gotta have a Libra moon. This man mad as hell. He don't know what to do with himself. He don't know what direction to go in. This man don't have no intuition. His intuition is blocked. He has absolutely no discernment. And if he ever had any, that's being blocked purposely. This man is losing everything by the second. And somebody here is, is tired of waiting. They feel like they got to catch up and get to you because this tower blowing back on that ass. Libra, do not take this person back in. If you know that somebody betrayed you to the highest power and they was in on like rituals and spell work trying to cause you endings and tower moments trying to block your path, trying to stunt your growth or trying to take you out completely, Libra, you would be a fucking fool to reconcile with somebody like that. Don't get God. Don't be don't be a simple bitch. All right, Libra? I'm serious. Don't be simple. Don't get God. Because this motherfucker is trying to come back towards you because this tower is too crazy for them. Like, these motherfuckers was dishing out shit that they can't handle. That's another reason why they stupid. Because you shouldn't be sending out shit that you can't handle when, if and when it comes back. Because it always do. Yeah, and that's the fucking truth. It always do. Come on. Stop playing this shit that you don't know nothing about. These motherfuckers ain't even built like that. They was just so sure that you was going to be heavily impacted and affected by this. And taken completely the fuck out for some of you. They was just so sure of this. And it didn't work. And now somebody here want to come towards you because they trying to avoid this tower. Get the fuck out of here. Take that shit up on the chin. Stay prayed up the same way Libra had to be. Yeah, stay prayed up the same way you had to be prayed up, Libra. Tell these motherfuckers stay prayed up. Yeah, eight of wands in the reverse. For some of you, you could have blocked communication with these people. Or you could just simply be ignoring them if they're reaching out. Okay? You don't owe these people shit. You don't owe them a motherfucking thing. Yeah, eight of wands in a reverse here to the eight of cups. You walking away. Walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve you for your highest good. And feeling good about it. Eight of wands in a reverse to the eight of cups. To the uh, chariot, okay? Moving forward triumphantly. Your road is open. Your pathway is clear. Them same uh, roadblocks, them same blockages and obstacles that they wanted to create for you along your path. That shit is now on their path. They have no path. That shit is a one-way street. One-way street, one-way ticket, straight to the motherfucking pit, straight to hell. Because that's where the fuck they belong. Yeah, these people try to cast illusions on you, Libra. They also try to do glamour spells on other people so that other people could see you in the narrative that they were spinning for you. These people were speaking ill on you, spreading rumors, saying nasty shit about you. And they was doing glamour spells so that people could see you in that, in that same light okay whatever narrative they were spinning about you they was doing glamour magic so that people could actually see you in that light so that they could be um you know believable you know so that these people could be seen as people that are telling the truth and people that are you know just spreading the word about you <laughs> libra you're a horrible person fuck out of here you got the nine of pentacles here okay very independent libra that's another reason why they mad they mad because you don't need them for shit these people thought you was going to be begging and crying and needing them for shit. You know, people love to treat you like shit when they know that you're dependent on them. Libra, you're not dependent on nobody. And that's another reason why they mad. So they still want to treat you like shit because you ain't dependent on them. Come on now. It's narcissistic abuse. That shit never ends. Anybody that has ever survived um, the abuse of a narcissist, you know this shit. You know this is something that we got to spread the word about. We got to talk about this shit. Because these motherfuckers are straight demons on earth. And I don't give a fuck if it's a mental illness or not. Y'all motherfuckers is demons. Yeah. 
Libra, I feel like you're making a choice here to trust your intuition as you should when it comes to these past people. Now these past people are going to be saying that they miss you. It could be a Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn that can't stop thinking about you. This person know they fucked up. This woman knows she fucked up. She could be feeling a little bad about it, you know. She could. Because she getting karma. Will of Fortune reverse. Motherfuckers always feel bad when they getting karma. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But if you wasn't getting no karma, would you still be feeling bad? Hell no. Nah. These motherfuckers would be on their vacation trips that they was planning in advance. Yeah, now somebody here restless, they can't sleep. You know what I'm saying? Somebody here always thinking about you, tossing and turning, they can't sleep. This bitch is haunted. Somebody here could be a water sign or another Libra like you. Or they could have strong water or Libra, Gemini, Aquarius in their chart. Uh, but this bitch is tossing and turning as well. Because she snaked you. She, sneak, she snuck you, you know. All these simple bitches had to be promised was, you know, a couple dollars. You know what I'm saying? That's all. It was easy to bribe these motherfuckers. For some of you, it was easy to bribe certain people. And certain, certain people had it out for you anyway because they always been jealous of you. So they was like, hell yeah, shit, I'll betray that bitch for free. I was just waiting on the opportunity to group up with a set of motherfuckers to go against Libra. Fuck that bitch. You know what I'm saying? These are hateful, envious, jealous souls. And now they all depressed. Somebody here could be a Taurus, a Virgo, a Pisces, another Libra. They could have that in their chart. Cancer. Yeah, these hoes is depressed now. Yeah, they facing poverty and they don't like it. Libra, I need you. I need your help. Some of these motherfuckers know good damn well that you ain't helping them. Okay? So they're not even going to waste their time. They know that that shit going to hurt for you to say no. They don't even want to hear it. And then for others of you, these people are too prideful. And then for some, they're going to be bold enough and have the audacity to try, try to come back around five of pentacles in the reverse. Because they under judgment. Motherfuckers want to come back to you now. The same person that they tried to take out. The same person that they've been abusing all these fucking years. The same person that they um definitely slandered and talked shit about and gossip about. Now they need your help. Now they want to come back around. Because this judgment is too harsh. These towel moments are too extreme. Look at this shit. These people going to be fucking going through it. Clutching their motherfucking pearls. Clutching their pearls. Okay, getting the rest of the edges that they have fucking snatched the fuck off. They edges getting snatched clean off the rest of them that they have. Because I'm hearing some of these bitches barely got edges. But we got the judgment in the reverse, the will of fortune reverse, and the tile reverse. When I tell you they getting that ass tossed the fuck up, they getting trampled on. God is like really spinning the block about you, bro. He getting at them. God getting at him. That shit is happening right now. God is getting at him. This is current time we talking about. Yeah. This is a harsh lesson for these people. Somebody here may be wanting to apologize, say sorry. That's fine, Libra. You have a forgiving heart. That's why you're an earth angel. That's why you're so blessed. That's why God favor you so much because you have a forgiving heart. You, you nothing like these people. If somebody did this type of shit to any of them... They would have lost their mind trying to seek revenge and do all this shit. Nah, Libra, you said God going to get at you worse than I could, worse than I ever could. Judgment in reverse, will of fortune reverse, tile reverse. God going to get at you worse than I ever could. You just put yourself in poverty. You just curse yourself for many years to come. Some of these people have cursed themselves in this lifetime and in the next coming for you. You like, come on now. I could never get at you like that. God going to get at you crazy. He going to get you where it really hurt. He going to get you worse than I ever could. Vengeance is not mine. It is the Lord's. Libra, you sat still like God told you to. And all he did was protect you like he promised you would. You know that the Most High keep his promises when it comes to you. He protected you throughout all of this. He said, just sit still, Libra. I'm going to show you, though. I'm going to show you what's going on. I'm going to let you feel it a little bit, too. I'm going to show you who's doing it. I'm going to let you feel it a little bit. And then I'm going to handle these motherfuckers accordingly. But don't you do nothing about it. Don't you do anything, Libra. Just sit still and let me take care of it. I see what the fuck is going on. Let me handle it. I got I got it, Libra. I could take it from here. God saw what the fuck was going on. He said, I got it, Libra. I could take it from here. I got you. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Yeah, fake ass motherfuckers. Now they don't want to cycle the clothes out between you two. They was fucking playing the funerals and all types of shit for some of y'all. And now they got the nerve to not want to cycle the clothes out with y'all. The fuck out of here. 
I never can say goodbye. Yeah. Now somebody got the nerve to also be saying that they love you. The fuck out of here. Whoever this King of Cups is, they knew what the fuck was going on too. All of these people knew what the hell was going on. They all was in codes. Yeah. Now you got somebody saying that they in love with you. They don't want the cycle to close out. King of Cups. Fuck out of here, King of Cups. Let's see. Somebody here saying that they in love with you. Yeah. Because you ain't dead yet. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So they in love with you. Because they ain't get no money, they in love with you. Mm -hmm. This is somebody that worked together with a Queen of Wands in reverse. A very jealous, envious, spiteful, hateful bitch. That's the bitch that they work together with. This person could be a Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces, and they could have worked together with a Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo. But this was for money. These people are thieves. These people, they sit up and plot on They plot and scheme how they're going to take shit from other people. But they don't put that effort into actually working hard for themselves. Come on now, boss the fuck up. Get that shit, get that shit the legal way. You fucking coward, you fucking chump. Yeah, now these people are scared, they're worried because that justice is coming. These motherfuckers got legal issues now. Oh yeah, Libra, these motherfuckers got legal issues because they were scamming out here. Not only was they plotting on you, trying to take from you, trying to take you out, trying to pin these scams on you, trying to set you up for the fraud that they are, um, trying to set you up for the fraud that they are participating in, right? Not only was they doing all of that, these motherfuckers was doing this shit to other people too. Okay? Swiping no swiping ass niggas. These people was doing this shit to other people as well. And all of that shit is catching up to them. Somebody going to jail. Somebody's going to jail. Somebody going to jail. Somebody here put a motherfucking light on them. Libra, I've told y'all this before. Anytime you come for somebody that's truly anointed by the most high, anytime you come for a chosen one, you have a light that's shed on you. You have a light that's reflected upon your fucking head. You automatically become, you automatically go into the spotlight when you are in a chosen one's energy. Whether you have good intentions or not, you have a light being reflected upon you when you are in a chosen one's energy. Now, if you are choosing to move like a fucking snake and to snake and sneak this person and to, um, you know, finesse this person, God already got his hitters on speed dial about you because you somebody that's already being watched because when you come for a chosen one, they're always being watched. When you are one of God's elect, when you are truly anointed, when you are a chosen one, you are being watched by the Most High 24-7, 365, 366 in Olympia. Anybody that come in your energy, whether they got good intentions or not, they're also under surveillance. And the minute that they fuck up and do some foul shit, they done already put karma on themselves. Libra. You rule justice. You are karma. And then on top of that, you a chosen one. You anointed. These motherfuckers played a dangerous game. That's karma tenfold. That's karma times ten. You rule karma, Libra. You walk with judgment angels. You literally all walk and breathe in karma. God used you as bait. He do this shit all the time, Libra. You know God be using you as bait for these motherfucking narcissists, these parasites, these narcissistic, parasitic, sadistic motherfuckers. God use you as bait all the time. He just dangle you in their face. Look at this. Easy pray. Easy pray, guys. This person's all alone. They're an introvert. They're all alone. They're so nice. They're so sweet. They feel like everybody in the world is good. They're so loving. All they doing is spreading love and positivity. Don't you want to fuck with this person? They're easy prey. You won't get caught. They're all alone. Who's going to help them? How would they ever know? Who's going to know? How would they know? You know, you just get dangled in these people's face. You know what I'm saying? You drenched in blood and they're sharks. <laughs> God use you as bait every time. 
And then he turn around and say, got him. <laughs> devil, devil turn around and say, got him. <laughs> the devil catch these motherfuckers so fucking fast. It don't even make no sense. You literally be being used as bait, Libra. Because God and the devil been trying to get at these motherfuckers for a second now. So they said, okay, we're going to send a chosen one in. We know that they're going to betray them in 0. 0.2 seconds. And we're going to get at them. We're going to snatch them up. These people got fucking tricked. They got bamboozled. Yeah. Karmic motherfuckers. Empress in a reverse here. King of Pentacles reverse. Queen of Pentacles reverse. Money hungry vultures. Motherfuckers that are sellouts. They sell their souls for money. These people are now watching you. Now watching you. Seeing that nothing they did worked. It only built you stronger. You're not heavily burdened. You're not stressed out. You don't give a fuck about them. You're not helping them. You're not mad. You don't give a fuck. You would actually have to care to give a fuck. You're not mad at all. You know that these people are deceptive. You know about the spell work that they were doing. You know about everything that they've been doing for years now. This shit ain't just begun. Come on now. You know about all this shit. And they like, damn, you taking a leap of faith in a new direction? Damn, you getting your wishes met? All your wishes is coming true? Damn, you getting your wish fulfillment? Damn, we unhappy and miserable over here? Damn, we still sending you the evil eye? And you just keep winning? Yeah, go ahead. Keep wishing ill. I encourage you to. I want you to. Because you only putting yourself in that fucking pit quicker. The more ill you keep wishing on this chosen one, the quicker your ass is going in the motherfucking dirt. And not only when you get in the dirt, and when you fucking pass away, when you take your last fucking breath, you still not going to be at peace. You still not going to be rested. Your soul is going to be restless. You're not going to transition peacefully. You are going to be a tormented soul. And don't you ever fucking forget that. You think you scared now? You ain't seen shit yet. When God, when God cuts you down and then finally you take your last motherfucking breath, he going to make sure that you a tormented soul. There is no rest for the wicked. You will never be at peace. You're going to experience hell on earth before you actually pass away. And when you kick the fucking bucket, you're going to be living in that bitch for all eternity. And you're going to be tormented for all eternity. You will not be well rested. These people are going to be tormented souls. Tormented souls. Tormented souls, Libra. No rest. No peace. These motherfuckers are going to experience extreme poverty and loss and sadness and grief and depression while you're celebrating. While you're celebrating, they will be experiencing that here on earth. But their days are numbered. And when they take their last breath, they're going to be tormented for all eternity. That's what God said. That's their karma. Coming for you. Somebody here is like, that's extreme. Like, no, not really. You wanted to take this person out. Libra, for some of you, these people is at, trying to take you clean the fuck out. Who the fuck are you to be saying that this is the time for somebody to go? Who the fuck are you exactly to be calling those kind of shots over some fucking money? <laughs> Yeah, God got something for that ass. Over some fucking money. They were saying, Libra, it was your time to go. <laughs> oh, yeah, God got something for him. Mm -hmm, he got something for him. Oh, he got something sweet lined up for him. Hmm. God got something sweet for these motherfuckers. Got something lined up for him, Libra. Now somebody is trying to repent. Somebody here is crying now and they in their feelings. We got water and we got repentance. Somebody here could be praying, trying to get right with God, trying to find him. Because you definitely don't know who he is. You out here doing wicked shit like that, you don't know who the Lord is. Don't even act like you know who he is. They trying to find him now. They trying to get to know him. <clears throat> yeah, it was a fire sign. I told you, we kept getting Leo. For some of you, you have fire signs going against you. But we kept getting Leo. Could be an Aries, could be a Sagittarius as well. 
Yeah, we did see Sagittarius too. Yeah, you have fire signs going against you. And it says fears was making you question it. Okay, Libra. So some of you, you have a union that was being attacked. But this person is your happy home. Yeah, this is a, a spiritual union, a spiritual contract, a spiritual partnership that you have with somebody. This is your Ten of Cups, Libra. Also, Spirit is saying that if these people were attacking your foundation, you can now rest, okay? You've been resting. Shit, if you anything like me, you could rest in the middle of a storm. That's how much protection you got, Libra. You could rest in the middle of the storm. And people would be confused as to why you at peace in the middle of a storm. That's God. That's God's grace. That's God's shield. That's the protection of God. You cloaked in God's armor. Understand that. Confirmation. But rest and rejuvenate Ten of Cups. Libra, for some of you, you could even be moving. Okay? Congratulations. Safe travels. But you could rest easy, Libra. Rest and rejuvenate Ten of Cups. Also, like I said, you got passion being uh, ignited in your life. For some of you, you're going into union with somebody. And whoever this person is that you're coming into union with, this union was being attacked by these same people. This union was being attacked by multiple people here. But you and this person both know that it feels like home. You both feel like home. It feels like home to be together. This is your person. It could have been a Gemini that was attacking y'all. But you see the truth about a situation, and so does this person for some of you. Okay? Take it as it resonates. But Libra, you going in a new direction. Okay? But whoever this is, this Gemini, this Virgo, whoever these people are, they was attacking your foundation. They was attacking your stability. They was attacking your union. And they wanted you and your person to go in a new direction. They don't want y'all to be together. They want y'all to go in a new direction. Somebody here wants you to miss out on money opportunities, attacking your finances. Somebody here wants you to self-sabotage so that you'll miss out on your blessings, which includes you being with your true soulmate and includes you go, you um manifesting wealth for yourself. You have a lot of wealth, a lot of abundance surrounding you, Libra. But understand that you're going to have that with or without this person. But for many of you, you have a soul contract to fulfill with this person. And these motherfuckers knew it and they was attacking it. Strong Gemini. I'm telling you, we got Gemini here twice in the reverse. Could have been an Aries Leo or Sagittarius as well. You have multiple people here attacking this. Because they know that your stability is secure. Your foundation is secure. Everything is secure. The Hierophant. God is moving mountains on your behalf. God is working miracles in your life. These people see this shit. It's undeniable. They can't even deny it. You know what I'm saying? God is moving fucking mountains for your ass. Okay? And all you got to do is just sit still. Be quiet. All you got to do is sit still. Let God work for you. Some of you could be born October 6th, October 9th, October 5th. You could be a life path number 6, 9, or 5. Okay? Something significant about those numbers. 596, 569, 695. Nine nine six five, you know, something significant about those three numbers. But these people are upset now. Temperance in the reverse. They pissed off because they codependent. They codependent on you. They codependent on your person. They don't want you two to come together. They was doing everything in their power to keep you two from being together. Doing everything in their power to block you off from your protection. To come between you and your ancestors, you and your creator. Now these people are wanting to repent. Yeah, go ahead and get on your knees, bitch, and pray. Yeah, we got the sun card here. Somebody here sees how happy you are. Somebody here sees that you're moving forward. Somebody here sees that you're being celebrated, and that's the best revenge. Best revenge is your paper. Best revenge is letting these motherfuckers get front row seats to your blessings. Letting these motherfuckers see that they ain't stopped shit. You did all of that, and you ain't stop a motherfucking thing. That's the best revenge. These people don't know how to act. They don't know how to feel. Somebody here could be a Pisces. Fucking upset. They upset. They unwilling to accept this defeat. There's no way, Libra. There's no way this shit went in your favor. There's no fucking way you a chosen one. There's no fucking way you a earth angel. There's no fucking way I can't sacrifice you. There's no fucking way. This emperor in the reverse is pissed. This could be somebody that was abusive and narcissistic. Okay, this person is a narcissist. This person is abusive. This could be a karmic lover of yours from your past. I told you it was another Libra going up against you. We got Libra. We got Pisces. We got Sagittarius. We got Gemini. We got Virgo. These people are all under judgment. All of them. Every last one of them. Under judgment. 
They about to lose so fucking much. The tower. These people about to lose so much. They about to lose so much because they came for a star. They came for a chosen one. They came for a star seed, an illuminated one. You are an illuminated being, Libra. You are a star. You are a healer. You a fucking shaman. For some of you, you are a reincarnation. Some of you could be seeing 919, 919, 119, 911. Some of you seeing 777, 717, 117. Some of you seeing angel number 222. You and your person could both be seeing a lot of twos because it's time for y'all to be together. You showing up as the high priestess, Libra. These motherfuckers came for a star seat, a chosen one, a reincarnation, somebody that's gifted, somebody that has immortality, somebody that's a high priest, a high priestess. That's who they came for. These motherfuckers signed their life away when they came for you. That was a suicide mission. That was a fucking suicide mission coming for somebody in your ranking. You could have tried to warn these people and they thought you was on a high horse. They thought you was just talking shit. You was blowing smoke up their ass. They see now that your warnings were correct. You were correct. Your income is constantly increasing, Libra. These motherfuckers ain't stopping motherfucking thing. Let the money fall on you, baby. And that's what they said. They done sold their souls for. They done sold out about this motherfucking money. Okay? And they ain't getting shit. And anything that they have accumulated, that shit is being stripped from them. These people are being completely stripped. They being cut the fuck down. God said he going to cut them down. They going to experience poverty before they leave this earth. Libra, your income is constantly increasing. You about to live a lifestyle that these motherfuckers could only dream for. These people was trying to kill, steal, and destroy to live the type of lifestyle that you about to be living. Hmm. <laughs> Was it worth it? No. No, it wasn't. Because I'm hearing for some of you, these people have very beautiful lives. And they ruined it. These people ruined their own destiny, their own paths. They ruined their opportunity to build a beautiful legacy for themselves. Being too concerned about what it is that you're growing, what it is that you got going on on your side. They was too busy competing. They was too busy comparing. They was too busy trying to steal, kill, and destroy what you was building. And so now, their whole foundation is crumbling. These people losing every fucking thing. So was it worth it? Absolutely not. Not only did you not get what you thought you was going to get, the person that you wanted to see suffer, they're being blessed times a million right in front of your fucking face. And you losing everything that you had before you even started this shit. Not only did you not get what you thought you was going to get. You're losing everything that you built for yourself over the years. Before you even started attacking this person. God cutting them down, Libra. He cutting them down. Libra, have a beautiful Friday. Enjoy your weekend, sugar. I'm going to talk to y'all soon. Peace.